What's going on, adventurers? Hey, adventurers. So today we are in a very special cemetery. Um, we actually are trying to locate the grave of Fred Gwynn, who actually was probably most known for playing the role of Herman Munster in The Munsters, which was an awesome TV show. Most of you guys know that um, that was probably one of the first like horror comedy shows that you know existed. It was about the same time as The Addams Family, so you know they kind of came out about the same time. Uh, really cool show, but little known fact, Mr. Gwynn has an unmarked grave, and we're not really sure why, so we're gonna try to uh, make communication with him today. And I brought something new today, guys. I have some dowsing rods, and they actually are really cool. They glow, like they're like LED, but you probably won't be able to see that because it's still light out. We're gonna attempt to find his grave, and then we're gonna try to talk to him for a little bit, and then we're gonna do a live stream, but we're gonna let you guys know in the live stream to come back and check this video out because this is the video where we're gonna find him. So, uh, we actually came up here before just to find out where this place was. It's pretty close to where we live. Other people have done videos here, but you know, obviously they don't know exactly where he's buried, so we're gonna find out today. And we're also gonna do some of the spirit box, right? Yeah, we're With, gonna do um, some spirit box sessions. We got the Necrophonic and the SB7. Last time we were here, it was really crazy. Lisa stayed in the car, we actually had the dogs with us, and I said, I'm just gonna kinda walk over and see if I can kinda figure out about where he's buried. I did that, and when I got to really close to where I think he was buried, heard footsteps behind me. I thought it was Lisa, it wasn't her. And I said, you know what, let's, uh, cause her knee was bothering her that day. I said, let's drive around. Cause there's actually an area you can drive around and park in the back of the cemetery. I said, let's do that. And we did that and we parked there for a minute and we just got this really uneasy vibe. And all of a sudden the dog started barking and there was a loud bang on the side of the car. And we're like, what the heck was that? It was definitely something not of this world. So I don't know if he doesn't want to be found or what the deal is, but I hope we're going to find out today guys. So let's do this. Real quick before we get into the video, just wanted to show you about these awesome dowsing rods. So I'm gonna turn off the lights and I'm gonna show you how they work. Check it out, guys. Oh yeah. Go ahead and calibrate for me. Awesome. What is my yes answer? Show me my yes answer. There it is. Go ahead and calibrate for me again. Good. What is my no answer? And there it is. Pretty awesome, guys. So anyway, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these to the cemetery and we're gonna attempt to find Fred Gwynn's grave. Now it's not gonna be nighttime when we go, so unfortunately they won't be lit up. Will you lead us to Fred Gwynn's unmarked grave? And we got a yes, guys. Okay, Jen's getting her dousing rods calibrated. And we think it's, she's, where I'm seeing is in the area, kind of the area, but we're not sure. So as she gets closer, you can watch the rods move. And she's basically asking it to help her find Fred Gwynn's grave. And she's just going to follow those. It's pointing over here. So they're definitely pointing the way she's walking. I have a feeling we're getting close, Doc. I have a feeling we're getting pretty close. Um, let me come up and you can see a little better, but I definitely see some mo movement with her. She's getting a lot of movement. And they're actually... Is this would, exactly where he is or is this just close by? All right, I'm going to take a couple steps forward. If this is not where he is, then I want you to open back up for me. Oh, okay. So I'm going to take a couple steps forward. Please cross when I am directly over his grave. Getting warmer. Oh. Is this is is this exactly where he is? 
saying yes. And if you look on the ground, I, obviously there's it's just grass here. Um, there's no marking, but Jen did some research and basically this is the general area she found. Okay, guys, so I'm, I'm going to take another step forward. I want you to uncross when I've passed his grave. I have a feeling it's like right here. It, oh, there oh, you go. What? That totally heck? uncraw and went reverse around you. What is going on? Now back Whoa. up. Maybe back up. Yep. Right Look here. At this. Look at this, guys. This is the real deal. This is unbelievable. I'm really new at using dowsing rods, too. Like, this is really the first time I've ever used them, especially for a video. I've practiced with them a couple times. Um, but I feel like they're really accurate, especially if you're in tune with your spiritual energy. And I've been working on that. So, um, wow. So, thank you for this. Now we're going to go ahead and do a spirit box session and see if we can talk to Mr. Quinn and find out why he wanted to be in an unmarked grave. Okay, guys, so this is the first time ever using the Necrophonic app. Been a little leery about it, but, you know, we said our prayer. We're good. And I just want to see what's going on. I want to see if we can make some contact with Mr. Gwyn. And hopefully he'll talk to us. All right, so we're going to start. I'm not sure if this is the right um, setting because I know that there's one with echo. I don't like that one. If that's what it is, I'm going to change it. I like the one with the rever reverb a little bit better. I feel like I can understand it. Um, so hopefully you guys are close enough to me. Turn the volume all the way up. Okay, we're good to go. All right, let's do it. Mr. Gwen, are you here? I'm gonna get a little close. Are we standing right next to your grave? Did you just hear something right next to us? Keep asking. Um, why, why did you want to be in an unmarked grave? Is this exactly where you're located? Brought. Brought. It is. Were you, were you mad when we came here last time? that we found you? So I know that you're probably upset about being known only as Herman Munster. I just wanted everybody to know that you are also a very popular children's book author and also an artist. A lot of people don't know that. Oh yeah. Is there anything else that you want people to know about you? Did you like acting? Hello. Who are we talking to? Fred, is that you? It's okay, we're friendly. We just came to talk to you. Hi. Hi. Who are we talking to now? Can you hear it, Mary? All right, so listen, I want to talk to Fred Gwynn again. Um, I just noticed something, but I don't know if you want to share it. Oh. Did you see this? I did not. Is this a possible clue? I just noticed in the ground here where Jen had the dousing rod indicator that Fred Gwynn was buried. We just see it. I don't know if that's a stone. I'm not going to touch it. <laughs> um, Mr. Gwynn, this little... He said what? Did oh, you hear that? Yes. Let me get back up here with you. 
Hello. Um, where it says forever here, is that where you're located? Yep. Is this your marker, Mr. Gwen? Out. Out. We don't mean you any harm. We're just, we we're just, just here we're to looking. visit. We're not touching it. We're not going to touch it. We're not touching it. We just noticed it in the grass here. What? Maybe he doesn't know it's there. Maybe it's new. Who put this? Who put this here for you? Stay. Somebody's wh whispering. I'm laughing. So we were thinking next time we come, maybe what we'll do is maybe we'll print out one of your um, pictures that you that you created as an artist and um, show everybody while we're doing our video. What do you, what do you think about that? Sure. sure. Yeah. Yep. Okay. okay, we'll do that. I'll bring it. So we were actually gonna um, we're gonna we're gonna do a live stream. So that our friends can watch as we're talking to you. Is that okay with you? Hi. All right, I'm gonna turn off this app. I think we're actually gonna use the SB7 maybe for the live stream. I might, we might go back to the next one. Yeah, that was see. awesome. Um, it was pretty interesting. It's the first time we've ever used it, so, you know. Can you repeat that, dot com, Edra? Did you say something.com? Do you want us to come back and visit you again then with the uh, picture? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we'll definitely do that. Thank you for talking to us. And we're sorry, um, you know, if, if you felt like we were invading your space. Uh, by the way, I'm Jen and this is Lisa. Jen. It was nice speaking with you, and we we wish you very much peace. Are you in heaven? Joy. Are you making the wind blow like this? All right, I'm gonna turn off the app. Hi. All right, I, hi. hi. Thank hi. you for talking to us. Bye bye. Bye bye. I hate turning it off because you always feel like you're hanging up on them or whatever. But uh, wow, that was pretty intense. Like that app is very intense. All right, guys. So I feel like we got a lot of amazing responses. Um, pretty impressive. And we're definitely gonna be coming back soon. Uh, we just kind of wanted to, first of all, find out where Mr. Gwen was buried and. I'm very confident that we did find the right place. It, it just feels like it, you know, you kind of just get that vibe. So, um, the wind's picking up. All the of a wind is crazy yeah, all of a sudden. It was not windy at all when we first got here, but now it's like, woo. Oh, that's <laughs> gusting. Yeah, it's gusting for sure. With that being said, we'll see you on our next Raptor, Raptor Adventure. Adventure.